Hey yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Today I'll be reacting to a Mr. Beast video of two people surviving in one room for 100 days. It's... Um... I'm sh I... I hope it's not like... Male and female, I guess. Or they're probably just gonna end up getting married or something. So yeah, without further ado, let's get right into it. I built a massive isolation chamber. And we're gonna... Good transition actually. I, I like that that sound is like like jung jung and then like it just like comes all around so like it just shows that yeah actually yeah. See if these two strangers can survive in this chamber for the next one hundred days. They have never met each other ever. Bailey? This what? That's why I said not to happen they I hope they're married at least, like male and female, I hope they're married or else there's something bad is gonna happen. This is Susie? Susie, this is Bailey. Nice to meet you. Hi, Bailey nice and Susie. Yeah. If the two of you can survive the next 100 they're days in here, I will give end. you the half a million dollars inside of this bowl. But if one of you... I don't know, like ever since like Mr. Beast gave one million dollars to some... To, there's some guy that put his hand on one million dollars once. He, I'm not sure. Like, he doesn't give a million dollars anymore. Like, he always gives like two fifty or five hundred. Or even for Squid Game video, he only gave about four hundred fifty six thousand dollars. So, yeah. He leaves before the hundred days is up. You both get nothing. All right, I think you guys understand the rules. Because Have fun. Hey, bye. This is gonna be crazy. I agree. Um, you don't know what yeah. This is actually like an insane asylum. They're currently looking at all the stuff we put in there. We gave them enough food for 100 days, which is healthy, but basically the exact same thing over and over again. We also gave them their own private bathroom, which comes with a shower and obviously has no cameras inside and a bed to sleep on. They have everything they need oh, to survive. Wow. At least there's two beds. Hundred days. It's just a question of do they want it. I got a comb. I don't know if I've ever combed my hair in my life. Interesting. See how they're both standing on different sides of the room? They're so awkward. When I had them take their blindfolds off, that was legitimately the first time they had ever met. I just keep thinking of the feeling, like, of exiting. Oh yeah. How good is that gonna feel? What? You just came in and you wanna go out? <laughs> It's only a hundred sleeps. It's only one hundred sleeps. And then the world will have just kept going. Mm -hmm. That's like what freaks me out. The most interesting part of this experiment oh, is that in this room, you have no idea what day or time it is. And already on night one, Susie and Bailey- Mr. Wings is basically just doing like his previous um, challenges that he did himself. He's just doing it now. And yeah, and also I forgot by the way, I smoke cigarettes, Cuban cigarettes now. I'm just kidding, it's just a, it's just a love letter. You, Yeah, just... Yeah, let's continue. You made the mistake of only sleeping for two hours. Which means they started their second day at 2.37 oh, a.m. I'm just gonna just act like this is just the new normal. Okay, what do you mean? Are you feeling beef or chicken? That all those cans look like the same thing, like it's different, it has vegetables and meat and stuff, but then it all looks like the same cans. So yeah. Chicken. Chicken sounds great. It's probably like some stuff from his previous videos maybe. Like the the one he trapped someone in the grocery store or something. I'm not sure. Uh, <laughs> wow, I think it I mean, if you basically have all this, I guess I'll just stay here for like a million days or something. Oh wait, it's 100 days. I mean, I would honestly easily be there for 100 days if I had company. Like, I had company and I had like this type of food. Like, look at what she's eat. Like, you get to cook something and like... You can just do some exercises or something and you have company so you don't get depressed. So yeah, 
makes sense. I I would stay there for more than a hundred days. But I'm again I'm lonely, so I'd I'd survive. Let's go. As you can see, living inside a white cube is pretty boring. Besides eating the same thing over and over, time in the chamber consisted of two things. Trying to hide from the bright light. The lights are just so bright that we have to make these things to shield ourselves. And desperate attempts to keep right. themselves entertained. Mr. Beast, that start off the lights for you. My goodness, Ten. Like on day bro. four, when they used the paper from their journals to make a deck of playing cards. He's making wow. cards? Alright, so I just finished my deck of cards. I think it actually came out alright. Which that's, honestly looked pretty fun. That's, that's fun. That's, uh... Yeah, that's fun, actually. Fun. So I made myself a $30,000 seat and joined in. <laughs> On day five, they made a sign-in sheet, which was really just an elaborate trip. What is this? We have to sign our sign-in sheet. Oh. Wait. What? Signage for what? These are our camera people. Yeah, this is everyone that's come in today. Wait, wait a minute. Oh, You're why? Oh wait, they are born actually. You're having them do this. You can track the date and the time. Hold on, I need to borrow this. No, 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 I wrote the date. I wrote the date. Which I gotta say was pretty smart. But by the time we got to day seven, anything considered smart was thrown out the window. Bailey's lost it. <laughs> He's whipping the <laughs> Wait, it's just day yeah, eight. You have, you, have, you have company and it's just day eight and what? You lost it so fast, man. Doesn't make sense. Five more throws. But I only need one. Let's freaking go, baby. It's actually crazy to me that already on day nine of You can open the door on your own. So that if you want to like step out, you could just like step out just like that. Cause I thought like you could just like call Jimmy or something and just tell him that, oh, I want to step out. So yeah, but I guess they decided just put the button in there, I guess. This challenge, they're bored enough to expose the red line that if they cross, they lose every dollar of their prize money. <laughs> it is now day number 10. This squad. God. And I got a pretty interesting offer. No! No! So it looks like they took the five hundred thousand dollars and put two hundred fifty on her side and two hundred fifty on his to remind themselves of what's at stake. This the whole door opening thing is so dramatic. How's it going? We're about to reveal the most interesting part of the challenge. I need you two to just face this wall. They don't even know that there's a door back here. Let's do this. That's <laughs> what. This is our first time seeing the outside world in 10 days. You are kidding me. The sky! Every 10 days, I will give you something that will make the challenge easier, but if you actually want it, you'll have to pay for it with some of your prize money. And first, oh. for day 10, we're going to give you the option to buy a private chef that will cook you whatever you want between now and the end of the challenge for $50,000. Before you answer, if you want to give up some of your prize money, we're going to let you have a nice meal. Use this as a floor for your imagination as to what you could be eating for nine more days. You are kidding me. 50 grand a lot though. Okay, let's not think about it right now. These look like some people that have only ate canned chicken for 10 days. I love just <laughs> looking at the sky. You forget that they literally haven't seen the sun in 10 days. Now I feel bad. After eating this, the thought of that food is like grossing is, me out it's even worse. Rough. They're starting to talk about whether well, they should that, take it. I, mean, that's I don't know what to do. This is a good person to attempt this with. <laughs> Oh no! All right, it's time for the decision. Would you pay fifty thousand dollars to have this for the rest of the channel? Honestly, I would, cause it's just fifty thousand. Like I'm getting five hundred thousand dollars, so like just giving up like fifty thousand. I guess it's it's good, but I'm not sure if it's like it is probably each actually. But if it's like that 50 grand, you just like split it into two, then I would definitely take it. But even if it's like 50,000, 50,000, take it, give it to Jimmy, then I, I would still do it if I'm gonna eat like gourmet food every day. Yeah, so I. Nope. I think we decided no. Really? I honestly didn't think you guys would say no. no. 
I guess they want all their money. It's good making sacrifices. So let's see his next offer. For 10 days. We'll see if he came then. I really thought you were going to say yes. Mm -hmm. That was crazy. Bye. I'm really curious about the next temptation is. I know. But you know what? I'm proud of us for staying strong. Good job. And now with the chef gone, it seemed like Susie and Bailey were already starting to regret their decision. Wow. Bon appetit. My favorite part is that you can hold it sideways. <laughs> <laughs> stays on the plane. The next few days were pretty mind-numbing for the both of them. Oh. Their routine- They actually, like, rearranged their whole place. Consisted of waking up, cooking food, and then eventually just going back to sleep. Man, the longer I'm in here, the more I feel like I'm sharing a space with an annoying sibling. <laughs> Talking about me? <laughs> Who else? <laughs> and even though they were getting used to each other, one thing they weren't getting used to were the constant beaming light. It's just so bright in there. I came to the bathroom because the, the light, you can keep it off. So it's nice and like dark in here. Once it gets super late at night, I physically feel my eyes stinging. Just Jimmy, come on, Jimmy. You, sh you should probably just off the lights. Like, it's like pity them, like, they're sitting there under the light and it's not like one light, it's just like so many lights pointing at them. Jimmy, come on, what is this, Jimmy? It's because of how bright the lights are in here. And because it was and so I hard for them to get any sleep, I had the perfect offer planned for day 20. Congrats, you're 20% done. Are you two ready for the offer? Yes. Yeah. Your day 20 offer is simple. I will give you each a smart bed that are super comfortable and combined will cost $50,000 of your prize money. I will also give you this iPad with the ability to turn off the light. Dang. You have exactly one hour to decide if they want to spend $50,000 of their prize money. For these beds and the ability to turn off the light. The answer might be yes. I haven't seen Susan this happy since he literally started the challenge. Let's remember what we would have to live with if we don't say yes. Oh, oh my gosh. I think they're gonna take it. I think we should. It's only 10% of our money. It's decision time. Your one hour is up. This is what your eyeballs could have, but if you say no, this is what you're stuck with. For 80 days straight. Do you want these comfortable beds? I'm actually yes. doing whatever you say. Five. Four. Oh my gosh. Three. I do whatever you say. Two. Yes or no? Really? Yes or one. No. What's your decision? No. Really? Okay, well, I did not. I feel like Bailey, you could have helped a bit. She was clueless on what to do, so I feel like Bailey could have helped. I see that one coming. She just like left the whole pressure on, on like, Bailey just left all the pressure on Susie and then like she wasn't sure about what to do so like she just said no honestly I would have said yes because it's just what 10% of the money that I think I made a mistake maybe oh what a heavy mistake I cannot believe you guys said no I'll leave you alone for a couple of days I hope you don't regret your decision bye bye I think we made the right I mean I mean, thinking about it now, they do have good beds, actually. They, I mean, they have a bed to sleep, so... Yeah, I think it's good. Decision. I can't believe that in the heat of the moment, you said no. Oh, I feel all that slight regret right now. I know. I feel no regret in your decision. <laughs> <laughs> so today, I made my calendar, and I was just writing my mom's birthday. It's gonna be tough on that day, I think. That's bad. She's not married yet. And if Bailey's not married, that probably sure they get gonna, they're gonna end up marrying each other, I guess. I'm so bored. I think that we're hitting a point where boredom is at like an all time high. I woke up this morning and didn't feel like doing anything. So I just sat there and stared. I think that's what Jimmy always feels in every challenge that he was in, so that's pretty normal, I guess. What are you gonna do with this money? I have a house. I was probably gonna pay a lot on the house. Honestly, I would get a house though if I had five 
hundred thousand dollars, I would get a house. I would put all this like most of this money into this channel, Turtle Plus YouTube channel that ninety nine percent of you are not subscribed and you should subscribe. So subscribe, um, because I'm poor and I need a life. So. And also, the main reason is like, I want to be the biggest entertainer in the world and I want to make you guys happy. I want to be like, my goal is to just like entertain half of the globe and just make people laugh and in their crazy ass life. So, subscribe and comment down below. It would really mean a lot to me. I read your comments. I really appreciate you guys. So, comment down below what you guys want me to change or something and yeah I'll, I'll try my best to keep you guys entertained just I haven't yet found my own style of entertainment yet so it might be vlogging maybe like I'm just trying that out a few times so let's see how yeah um yeah subscribe Make sure you hit that subscribe button, smack it in the face, and I love y'all, and I'll... Yeah, subscribe. And let's get back into the video. Honestly, Mr. B's videos are... It's interesting, but these videos recently, like, since it slowed down the pace, I, it's just like 10 minutes of the video. I already feel that, like, it's already too long. I mean, I know it's 100 days, but then, like, it feels like the video is too long and, like, it's a bit too draggy, I guess. But, yeah, you should still subscribe to Turtle Plus and probably not Mr. Beast. Actually, I'm just kidding. Subscribe to Mr. Beast and also subscribe to Turtle because I'm just a growing YouTuber and just an aspiring YouTuber. Just wanting to entertain you guys. Just wanting to make you laugh, so subscribe. For a moment, I thought she only has one leg, but yeah. Oh, that's awesome. I want to pay off my parents' debt. That would be like my ideal oh. world. Throughout the following days, I- That's a good thing to do, I guess. To make your parents debt-free. I made sure to not interrupt the routine. However, I was also taking note of things they missed. Well, Jimmy has a heart of not messing up routine's heart from the outside world. Like on day 24, when I overheard them wanting seasoning on their food. Okay, if we had seasoning, I could like, easily stay here 100 yeah. days. On day 27, Susie was craving coffee. I am a big coffee drinker, and um, I only have water. And on day 28, Bailey clearly needed entertainment. <laughs> so by day 30, I had the perfect plan to get them to spend money. It's now day 30, that's kind of perfect. They're offered. How's it going? Hi. Today's offer is simple. Each of these five items costs ten thousand dollars. Why am I sweating like a cow, bro? But I mean, I have a fan right there. I just didn't on it because if not, I disturb the audio. Obviously, you guys matter to me more than me. So yeah, I switched it off. But yeah, I'm sweating like a cow. You can buy one phone call. The entire Harry Potter. Maybe I should just quit smoking or else I'd get harder. Maybe just one more time. Okay, I'm done. And you guys shouldn't smoke. Your collection, your own top. Unless you're smoking a love letter, then yes, you should smoke love letters, but don't smoke real cigarettes or e cigarettes. Yeah. Machine. Spices, salt, and pepper for your food, or you can buy a Monopoly for $10,000. You can buy one of them, you can buy all five of them. This is tough, actually. If you have 10 minutes to decide, just let me know what you want. I would buy the Spices and the Monopoly game because Monopoly or books or Harry Potter, I think maybe it's if it's Harry Potter, like. A movie DVD or something then probably I would take it but it's just books so I probably would just go for Monopoly and for my food I would definitely use um, spices after 30 days of 
not good food. Yeah. You can buy one of them. You can buy all five of them. This is tough, actually. If you have 10 minutes to decide, just let me know what you want. I'm so nervous. This is a big decision. Coffee. Oh, Ooh, it does sound kind of nice. I remember that guy. I know who Bailey is. Bailey is the cameraman from like Mr. B's old videos. I just I just remembered him. He's the cameraman from Mr. B's crew. Yeah. It does. And then the seasoning. Seasoning sounds nice too. Well, I'm doing this one one thousand. I think he's getting married or something to this. Oh wait, he says they just met. Or maybe he can't find a girlfriend, I guess. So, yeah, maybe Mr. Beast is helping him get a girlfriend. Thousand percent, I'll be honest with you. I don't really care about that. Sick. Coffee would be nice. That's like a treat every morning. I've made my mind up. Decision time. Are you buying no, the novels? No. 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 Are you buying the spices? No. no. Are you buying the coffee? Does it come with cream or sugar? Did you say yes in three seconds? Yes. Okay. Yay! Are you buying the Harry Potter book? Yes. Are you buying the phone call? No. no. We finally got you two to buy something. This feels good. <laughs> it was a pleasure doing business. Thanks for taking. I mean, 10 grand is okay, actually. I mean, it's not that bad. So now they have already oh each 10 grand, so it's 480,000. It's still good, actually. Hey, Ronnie. Most expensive coffee maker in the world. Oh, 30 days in, we got something new. That's exciting. We that's caved, you're welcome. That's my closet. That's my bookshelf. I can stay another 70 days easy. And we still have $480,000. It's crazy. Over the next few days, not a lot happened. She's already preparing a meal. It's like being married. The most interesting thing was when Hurricane Idalia. They mentioned it. I think they are actually getting married. Bailey and Susie. Took out the power on day 34. Oh, no way. No way. As you can imagine, oh. our cameras became pretty useless. Oh, no. So I'm just going to take you to day 39. How's it going? Hello. Hi. Hey. I know you guys have been struggling. I'm sorry it took so long. Hold up. Oh, there we go. That was oh. a long delay. <laughs> you should be able to use your coffee pot again. Honestly, from the perspective of like the lights being gone, I think they probably would have been happy. But the cameras were gone, so that makes no sense. So yeah. Cook food, you should have a hot shower. That's excellent. I'll see you tomorrow with the surprise. Oh, I'm so excited. Hey! The power's on! Look, it's light! It feels like cheerier. The lights are back on again. I just had a- I just saw a lizard just run by from like that way to that way on the ground. I just saw like something move and I just saw it and it was a lizard. And I'm actually frightened of them. So yeah, I'm just gonna continue watching and ignore the lizard, I guess. Hot meal, hot shower. Life is finally looking up here. It's now day 40. Can I come in? Come in! Your gift at no expense is this TV. What? Every single movie is $10,000 a pop. You have one hour oh. to decide, have fun. This oh. is crazy, the amount of- 10,000 for a DVD? That makes no sense at all. Movies in here. We can watch this documentary about Nolan. <laughs> we led Susie and Bailey to discuss the offer and told them we'd be back later, but they didn't seem too interested. How about 10 grand for all? I'll go ahead and tell you now. No. You might as well just come in here because I think we both are uh, set in our ways. Okay. The best I could do is buy one, get one half off. Mm. Can't do it. All right, get Get one off. Just buy one. Hey, come on in. Take every last one. I'll you gladly know. keep this. Oh, not any of the Hunger Games? I left the TV in the chamber to remind Susie and Bailey of what they could have had, but little did I know, oh, they were gonna outsmart me. An antenna is just a piece of metal. Rip this little wire off the wall. Oh. So I had to take this knife, oh, take the wire, it's like that's frame, oh and literally God. just plugged it into the antenna spot. Now we're gonna see if it works. Just anything, give us one channel. Oh. 
What? It says that there's seven digital channels. Oh my gosh. And this actually works. <gasps> Ooh. Oh my gosh, Dex, you got it. I'm like actually shaking. Bailey! Currently the only thing we can get on the TV is a race car race. Never really been a fan. Oh, wait a second! But today, all of a sudden, we're huge <laughs> race car fans. <laughs> Our time is gonna fly by. And Susie was right, because for the next wow. six days, that's all they did. Just watching TV. Having the TV Absolutely. feels like we're in purgatory. It's like almost normal life. It is my mom's birthday tomorrow. Even though I won't be able to spend the day with her, I got some time in here to make her a little birthday present. Although I didn't go out and buy something, I'm technically spending money on it. Tomorrow is day 50, so I'm gonna- That's smart. Technically spending money. <laughs> Use toilet paper to do streamers and decorate the room. I think you mean use toilet paper and do nonsense because it looks just like mess. It's day 50. Oh. Oh, hey. So what do you think your surprise is today? I have no idea. This do you just see, seems like unusually tall and also yes i'm scared of the lizard yeah one so is I'm a very big one tall. all right so the offer for day 50 is twenty thousand dollars for both of you to see your family they're in the other room watching that feed and they can hear everything we're saying hey i miss you guys i love you i miss you i'll be back in 10 minutes to hear if you're going to take the offer good luck 10 minutes this feels like a pretty easy oh decision oh my gosh i don't know this might be the only chance in this challenge to see them until the end. I think it's a no-brainer, personally. So it's up to you. Honestly, this video so far has been like... It's just like, normally, a Mr. Beast video is gonna be like... It's gonna be fast, but exciting at the same time. And then, like, it's gonna finish, like... It's gonna feel like it finishes fast, and then, like, you move on to the next video. Like, you click on another video, but then, like, this just seems, like, extremely long. I'm not sure why, actually. I think it's because, like, he... Because recently, Mr. Beast has been, like, slowing down the pace of his videos for some weird reason, I guess. Yeah. And I'm not sure, like, looking at his channel, the views has been going down a bit. I'm not sure why. I see like 200 million views in some some um, videos, but then like in this in his like recent videos, it has been like lesser. We'll spend yeah. 20 grand for both. Of course, I want to see my hair. He's a yes and she's a no. Oh God, tell me what to do. All right. I think you should stay. Where are you guys at? He's been a yes from the beginning. As soon as he said it. About 10 seconds left. But it's my mom's birthday today. I'm yeah. saying yes. All right, give me $20,000 and I'll go get him. Best 10K I ever spent, I think. Okay. They paid the 20 grand. Come on in. I'm so excited. To celebrate her birthday, we brought a birthday cake. Whoa! Whoa! This That's is the best cool. tasty thing they've had in forever. You know, honestly, I feel like Bailey and Susie are actually getting married if they are actually staying here and just a quick gulp of water. I spilled some on my shirt. Yeah. So that's fun. Little things like that that you don't realize you won't have until you're in it. Bye! Yeah. Bye! Bye. That's the worst feeling so far. The wow. highest of highs, Excellent. and now back to our little cute. That's how every Mr. Beast contestant actually feels, just missing their family. All alone. At the end of the day, family is everything. So, yeah. And also, the that's obey your parents and love them for the rest of your life.
Like I said earlier, the things we're offering them are based off of what we're overhearing them talk about in the queue. So you better believe that when Susie said this... Probably the only thing I'd say yes to at this point is like, if they do Tesla. You already know on day 60, I knew exactly what to surprise them with. How's it going? Hi! Oh hey, first things first, I brought you a giant mystery gift. Yay! Do the two of you want to spend $50,000 to keep what's inside of this box? Hmm. It's either going to be the best moment of my life or the worst moment. Like just give me your answer in an hour. Great. All right, thanks. We'll be thinking. 59 minutes remaining. I think we should. I know. I think it might be worth it. Imagine it is something great we said no. Would it ever be a car? Well, it could be. It could actually be the keys to a car. It's not going to be equal to the value that we're spending. She's right. It's almost three times more. I don't feel confident in the yes. No, let's say no. But are you sure? Yeah, if you're not confident. I just know they would never do a car. Yeah, they would. Really? Yeah, I feel like they can do anything. Let's just say no. Wait, now you have me wondering to say yes. Uh, Decision time! Okay, do you want to spend $50,000 to keep what's inside this box? Yes or no? No. Really? What is your answer? Uh, I'm going with no. Really? Yeah. I can't believe you guys didn't take it. Do you want to unlock it? Sure. I'm not sure what's inside. Alright, inside is $50,000, so you would have got your money back. And then you want to open up that stack of money, just grab that. Uh, here is a Tesla key for you, and a Tesla key for you. <laughs> I'm sorry. They would have gotten their money back, plus these two Teslas for free. Oh, I want to cry. Let's close this. That's only my dream. We're gonna head out. You leave the beef, thank you. Too bad, I guess. <laughs> That's wild. Bailey! Thank God it's Tesla's! I feel like we made the wrong decision. I'll regret this forever. Nah. I, yeah, I, I agree with you guys. Oh, I would have to be honest. Nah. I like Mike Frias. Okay, there, I said it. Okay. And after getting hit hard by yesterday's offer, Susie literally whined about the Tesla for nine days straight. It's really hard to see the positive in all this. I like actually won't be able to sleep. I'm actually feeling sick right now. I'm so mad. Susie's taking it hard. And so to make up for it, I made sure this next offer was the best one yet. It's day 70. Today's a big day because this is the last offer. So obviously on day 80, you're gonna be like, there's only 20 days left. And on day 90, you're gonna be like, why would we spend money? There's 10 days left, correct? Yeah. Let me just open the door. Oh okay. God. No shot you reject this offer. What you see here oh is everything you said no to so far in this challenge. Before I come to the price tag, I'm gonna move well, everything in here. I'm gonna make it as easy as possible for them to say yes. Nolan, just put those by the TV. Oh. As much as I love to bully Nolan, He's just dumb. <laughs> Here's the bag. If you guys say no, we have to move all of this back out. Well, then give us a good price. What you are considering buying is these two $30,000 beds, a brand new mystery box. This one doesn't have 50 grand inside it, it has something else. Sounds like mm -hmm. 25 grand. One phone call each, Spices Monopoly, every single movie, Walmart movie out. And lastly, the cook you said wow. no to. Oh, wow. there is a plate of food. I see a lot of good food. And to remind you how good it is, wow. here's some chicken Alfredo. That looks so good. It's time to find out how much this will cost you. Behind these curtains is a number. If you bid higher than that number, you get everything here for the rest of the challenge. But if you say one dollar, one penny lower, you get nothing. I'll give you an hour to figure out your bid. I'm thinking, what if it's like way low and they want us to say 150 grand? I think if we bid 75, that would be too little. They're thinking at least 100K. I actually feel like we should go a little bit lower because we were prepared to say no to it. That's true, but are you prepared to walk away with nothing? I would just say a big number. Like he said, like if you say lower, you don't get anything. If you say higher, you get something. So. You, you get it all, so I would just say like the biggest number I can think of. And while they're deciding what to do, I want to tell you about the Shop app. The Shop app is the best way to shop on your phone. And it's completely free. It'll basically look at everything you're interested in and recommend you products you love. This is the only wild card, because we know what beds are and we know what movies are. We don't know what's in here. I have a feeling I want whatever's inside. <laughs> whatever is inside is probably a Tesla or a car or something like that. I think. Like, that's what he's- It's actually a third contestant. Oh. And when you're ready to buy, you can speed through checkout using ShopPay. 
Let's do this. 80 grand 101. Because if they 70, I don't want to go under 70. I feel like this is like there's a space. I get what you're saying, but imagine that was the reason why we didn't end up getting all this. Yeah. I would be so sad. Shop app will even track all your packages in one place so you don't know exactly when they'll arrive for the holidays. Hundred thousand and one hundred dollars. Yeah, it's not really that much damage. Okay. This is, this is the one. Ready? Yeah. Official. Alright. We're flipping it. Wow. I hope we get it. Let the Shop App AI Assistant scan hundreds of millions of products all over the Shop App to recommend the perfect gifts for this That's holiday season. Ignorant. Time is up. What's the number? Let me see it. Before you do, uh, make sure you download the Shop App right now if no, you haven't no, no, already. No, I explained no, all the benefits no. of it. It's a beautiful, amazing app. Download the Shop App. Okay, what is your bid? If it's $1 below mine, you get nothing. 100,000, 101. Chandler, reveal it. <laughs> We did it! You overpaid oh. by 30. I don't care! We did the best! Yo, this is the most excited I've been so oh far. And this mystery box, which I did clarify was different, it's too. So to get everything? Whoa. That's this. Cool. Smaller Tesla. No, I oh. love this. I'll be teaming up with the shop app to grant thousands of wishes this holiday season. I'll That's tell you more about right. it at the end of the video. The Hot Wheels, the Hot Wheels Tesla is kind of. Um, it's, it's not necessary, so I don't think it's gonna play much of a role. Video. Um, Our room feels drastically different right now. <laughs> it's a dream! We now have so many things to do, it's like a vacation. It's an investment, for sure. I think it was well worth $100,000. You may think, oh, the challenge- Actually, I just feel like Bailey and Susie are actually getting married. Yeah. It's over now, but one of them may lose everything. You'll see on day 99 what I'm talking about. Oh my god, this is crazy. Now you would think that getting all this stuff would make both of them a lot happier. But strangely enough, the opposite actually started to happen. One thing I took for granted on the outside was a hot shower that I also did not share with anyone. The hot water tank here runs out so quickly and Bailey always showers before me. So I've been stuck showering with cold water for honestly a couple months now. We've been playing the same Monopoly game for like seven days because Susie refuses to play. Like I, maybe she just hates board games. Uh, I think we need to take like three days and cram as many movies as we can. All she ever does is read or watch movies. We gotta have like a movie marathon. So whenever. I'm like, can we just finish that game? She's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then it never ends up happening. It's impossible to get her to focus. Hey, do you want to watch The Notebook later? No, I don't want to watch The Notebook later. We just spent the last- So the last 20 days is becoming sort of like a problem between both of them since now they have everything. Because at the beginning, they didn't have anything. They only had each other. Now they have like so many things. So now each other is becoming a problem for them. Last like 25 minutes trying to choose a movie and Susie, what did you say you're about to go do? Shower. Sorry. She literally does this all the time. Yep. Bailey is wired right now. This happens literally every morning. He is just non-stop so energetic all the time. I just had to come in here because I can't go anywhere else. <laughs> That's a rave right there. Bailey, it's 3 a.m. Yeah, but sometimes you gotta rave. <laughs> oh, get me out of here. Too hard. <laughs> Jump from Monopoly. And also, I just remembered, I just remembered like, there's a lot of female viewership in my channel, so yeah, thanks girls and boys for for watching. I hope you subscribe. I hope like after this video, you guys subscribe to my channel and just be watch my videos even more and share them out with your friends and families and everyone. So don't subscribe to Mr. Beast. Don't download the shop app. Subscribe to Terra Plus YouTube channel. It will be the literally the best decision of your life. I guarantee you that for sure. Mm, nah. Do you know the dice are? Yeah. Oh, it is. I had them. Cause you keep asking me to play, so I was like, maybe if I just hide them, then we'll never be able to play. Oh. <laughs> That's smart. And rude oh, and that. Your toes look so long. No, that's <laughs> sickening. My dogs are barking. You. Oh, I would like to be saved.
Mama ready to leave. Even though at this point they could hardly stand each other, with the end so close, they set their differences aside and counted down the days. Four days left. Three. And Bailey, whoa. Well, it's gonna be. Really couldn't wait to walk out those doors. <laughs> oh, I wasn't in the middle of saying anything. All right, day 99. For me, it feels like it's been honestly an entire year. I can't imagine what they're feeling. I have to brush my teeth yeah, one more time. Ever. Um, 24 hours remain. This many. Yes. So this is the first second of the challenge when you both walked in. Oh my gosh. How is that us? I feel like I look like a fetus in that. <laughs> Come on in, gentlemen. Set it up right above the door. Oh, this is so exciting. You have my laptop only has 40% left. Officially have 24 hours left in the challenge. Yeah. Don't forget what I said. We got a fun twist for tomorrow. I'm scared. Do you think we'll still be friends That's after this? Depends what their answer is tomorrow. I'm worried that it's gonna be double or nothing. He's so like quiet about it. You can't it. guess. Yeah. And with their final night coming to an end, it was time to present them with an opportunity to double their money. Well, hey everyone. Whoa. This is chaotic. What is going on? Hello. <laughs> Jimmy hired a bunch of bodyguards that look like his bodyguards. Not his bodyguards, he looked like his butlers from the hotel video, that one million dollar hotel video. So I mean, look, they look like them to like take apart the whole room, everything inside of it. Cool. Hey boy, I want to help, but not really. They're literally just taking everything. Do you know what these are? Those are our blindfolds from the first day. Oh. That was quick. I remember like it was yesterday. If you would both please put them back on. Let's see if they want to double their yeah. money. Yay! Oh my gosh, my heart is actually getting out of my chest. A hundred days ago they were strangers. One hour ago they were best friends. Let's see if they become total enemies. Bailey and Susie, oh. take your blindfolds off. Yeah, steal. So, you might be familiar with what we're about to oh, offer you. No. You each have the choice to oh. split the money. And nothing changes. You both hit split, you just split it, keep what you have. Or, if you hit steal, you can steal the other person's money. And if you both hit steal, you would get nothing. Susie has earplugs in and noise cancellation headphones on top of them. She can't hear it. Oh, what's going through it? I don't even like know. Susie, if you hit steal, I can't imagine. What do you say to somebody that steals 180 whatever? Maybe you get ahead of it and you steal it. There. You hear that? Bailey actually might. Bailey might. All right, throw the music back in his ears. What if, while we were over there, he was like, oh, this is a no-brainer, it's too much money. We would never speak again. You guys have become, like, such close friends. I don't know, you get to know anyone, and when you've gone through the same thing, and, like, how hard this challenge has been, like, we both I deserve that, I for sure. And now you make me nervous! Like, I could do it, too. Whoa. What is she just saying? Maybe it'll be a case of you think you know someone. I don't know. If both of them press the steal button, they literally spend a hundred days in this room together for absolutely nothing. There's 30 seconds left in the challenge. At the very last second, I want you both to place your vote. Do you want to walk away with 360 grand or half of it? No one speak. Carl and Chris, you two don't talk either. You know that Susie's gonna split, but the thought of walking away with almost $360,000, that could do so much. Do you want to split the money or steal it? The fact that I entered this challenge Three. knowing that there would be pretty dark times ahead Two. and I still overcame all those things, One. there's no price you can put on that. <laughs> no way. If the room turns red, then someone stole. If the room turns green, then you split the money. <laughs> oh, whoa. I want you to know in the video, don't forget to download the shop app. If you saw my store in the shop app, you can see. Don't download the shop app. Don't subscribe to Mr. Beast on YouTube. Subscribe to Terra Plus. It will be literally the best decision of your life. Like literally, I checked YouTube and 99% of you are not subscribed. I will really, really appreciate you guys if you guys subscribe to the channel. Comment down below what do you think you want me to do in this channel? Whatever, whatever the heck you want. You want me to buy the whole earth or you want me to burn myself or something like that? Just comment at whatever you want. I love you all. I just want to make you guys happy. I just want to make you guys 
feel entertained thank you guys for watching take it easy fam i'll see you guys in the next video subscribe subscribe to the channel thank you guys